Hello everybody, this is Karan here. You are welcome to Tech Karan YouTube channel. And in this video, I am going to show you the review of Arrow OS Custom Room based on Android 10 for Redmi Note 8. As you can see, we are using Arrow OS version 10.0 unofficial with security patch of 1st of January 2020 and these are the things you get in this custom room what are the things working what are the bugs you get in this room and is everything is working or not everything in this video so make sure you watch this video till the end now let's get straight to the video So as always let's start with the home launcher as you can see by swiping right you get the normal google feed you get launcher launcher inbuilt if you flash my given google apps you need google apps it has no pre-built google apps you get this only custom room and you have to flash google apps manually by swiping right you get the uh, google feed and by swiping left now let's move on to the quick setting tiles you can see these are the quick setting tiles which you can customize from here and when you click here you can change these things uh, this has the new option brightness bar tweaks which you can change which you can enable or disable some options like show brightness bar brightness bar bottom and brightness icons these are the things the newest things uh, in uh, you got in this room and now let's go to other things first of all let's go to camera as we know that you get the normal snapdragon camera as you can see and is google camera is working yes it is working i have tried and tested and google camera is working perfectly clicking images perfectly when you go to portrait mode it is also working night set is also working almost all features of this google camera is working so no issues in google camera at all i have some news for you you get some bugs the end not some bugs only single bug but that is a very major bug you can see the uh, signal icons are there these can be dropped at any time whenever you receive a call the signals can be gone and you will not be able to pick a call but yes you will be able to back call that person it happened with me around almost every time so this is a bug i am again telling this is a bug so make sure to accept this bug whenever you're going to try this custom room so now let's move on to settings features in network and internet you get the wi-fi the sims and other things you get the option of traffic indicators show net activity if you want network speed indicator on your status bar and also you get the wi-fi calling option inbuilt here wi-fi calling option is available which you can use and now you get the option of roaming indicator hotspot and tethering inbuilt in this data saver vpn and private dns these are the things you get and uh, apps and notifications battery you have these things in your battery menu which you can customize battery percentage lock screen charging info battery manager battery charging light is available these are the things you get in this room and by clicking here you can see the battery usage uh, of your device now first of all let's take a break and let me show you my back cover yes this is the back cover uh, i am using on my redmi note 8 and if you like this back cover you can buy now on flipkart and the link for this back cover is, is in description go and check it out this cover looks seriously great you can see with stand and the build quality is just awesome so you can give it a try at least once now let's move on back to the video and whenever you go to display you get these options adaptive brightness styles and wallpapers in styles and wallpapers you can customize your own theme just click on custom first of all you can change the fonts whatever fonts you like just click on next you can change the icons whichever icons you like and these four type of icons you get okay let me choose the second one click on next you can choose the color whichever color you like so i like uh, this one the pink one just click on next and then you can change the shape i will not change then just simply name your style like i will name my style to tech current just click on apply and let me see if it is working yes it is working you can see the fonts are changed now 
and whenever you go swipe down you can see the colors are also changed the status bar icons are also changed so styles and wallpapers working perfectly you can change the clock style also if you want and analog only three clock styles are available in this room font size double tap to wake double tap to wake is working i think yes double tap to wake is working no issues at all wake on plug and here you have the option of dark theme which you can enable from here and these are the status bar items you get which items you want hd is here you can see it means wi-fi it means the volt is properly working you can use it you can use geo sims at all and in weather you can choose these settings whichever suits you now let's move on to other things in sound storage these are the things normal things you get in account security security you get the fingerprint and fingerprint is working find my device is on google play system update is working no issues at all now let's move on to gestures you get these gestures system navigation as you can see i'm using full screen gestures also you can hide that pill that uh, irritating pill you can see you can see this pill you can hide and enable this so you will see the full gesture experience in this custom room and now let's move on back again and what are the other things you get in buttons menu you have the power menu and you can adjust these options no extra features are there all features are included in these settings playback control options are there now let's move on to digital well-being all things are same and system and go to gestures gestures wall are available on the previous menu developer options these are the normal things you get you can try it on your own so this was all from this video review and let me show you how you can install this custom room first of all let's boot into custom recovery make sure you have a proper backup of your device in case something happens to your device i'm not responsible for anything happens and i will recommend you to use pitch black custom recovery as always you can use any other custom recovery too but that's not my choice and anything happens to your device will not be my fault just click on wipe advanced wipe dalvik catch system vendor data just click on swipe to wipe now let's go back back and again go to install here locate where you have downloaded that file where just simply click here swipe to confirm flash and then just go back and then flash google apps where you have downloaded and located simply click here swipe to confirm flash and then simply reboot your device and after that after first boot properly set up your device then you can move back to recovery and install magisk 20.3 if you want if you want to root on your device so this was all the steps and simply confirm flash and that was it from today's video i hope you like it and thanks for watching see you in the next video goodbye